Hello everyone, good to see you all. Uh, we are currently at 1572 ELO, and if we get just a couple more wins, we'll be up to 1600, and well on our way to 17, 1800, and finally 2K. So, I'm very excited to win this game today. Let's see who we're going to play. We are playing a 1601 from Croatia, Dobo Draghi, And we're going to play some solid chess. So we will control the center of the board from the side, develop our knight, fighting for this square. He brings his bishop out. Let's, um, let's open up this diagonal for our bishop. We will Fanchetto. Our dark squared bishop on this long diagonal. And now I think we develop our second piece. It's very standard and I will castle. Very standard opening. I've had this opening a billion times. Um, it looks like he's wanting to push here. He's supporting here with the bishop and the pawn. We have two attackers here. So if he does push, we just take and take, and then this file will be open. I think, do I want to bring my bishop out here? He'll probably push. Then we come back to here. I think I'm going to, I think, yeah, I think I'm going to develop my uh, rook here so I can push push this pawn up and try to control the center with these two center pawns here. This this is what he's doing anyway here. Okay. Um, something like this. I mean, he's basically done the same thing. I think... Okay, I think if I push here and he does something like this, I can force this bishop back and then I can push this pawn and basically have pawns on all the white squares and his uh, white square bishop will not be in the game so much. So we'll see if he pushes here. He didn't. I'm still going to do this. He's moving very quickly. He's only used about 20 seconds. I'm going to push this. Okay, okay, I have two attackers here. Two knights attacking this. He needs to defend, probably. Probably rook e1. Okay, queen e2. How do I get an advantage here? Do I come here? isn't bad what if I go here and he goes here and then I take he takes I take he takes I take he takes he kind of wins that I'm just gonna push this okay maybe a mistake I don't know his white square bishop's gonna want to come out here so that I'm seeing this knight develop over here This is a tough game. My white square bishop is also kind of bad. What if I push this pawn? Get my knight onto this square. I'm already... Yeah, I think this is the way to go. I want him to take... Yeah, okay. Good. There's a rule in chess. To take is a mistake. See, if I take here... Queen comes up. I can't move this piece because it'll be pinned. Taking queen here, you can take and I go here. I just like his position a little bit more.
I think this is the move. These pieces are not developed. Okay. I go here, he wins, and, um, and then he's controlling a whole bunch here. He's finding very good moves, I think. Um, so I can't take this anymore. But we do have Knight up to here. Just another rule in chess, or another thing in chess you want to try to be doing is getting into the enemy's area. You want to just be in his half of the board. Um, you know, these, these uh, rows here. So, like, here is already giving me this where I threaten the rook and the queen. He's defending. Hmm. Wrap <clears throat> queen up and over. Then he takes here. I want to connect the rooks. I'd be very happy if he treated here. Oh, I didn't even see this. Okay, I'm gonna have to recapture. I just moved too quick. Okay, rook up and we're threatening here. Can't take here because of this. We have two defenders on this knight. I'm gonna pull back, so I'm still on this. I can't come here because of the knight, but I can go here. And when he takes, come in here and here. This this looks okay. He could come like this though. Hmm. We're still in danger. Looking like a draw. I need to get here. I need to get onto this square, but I can't. Okay, I'm gonna just develop here. And we have check threat here. We are dying a pawn because I wasn't paying attention in the middle game there for just one move. We also have this threat, force the king away and we take back rank but then he could maybe I don't know it could be something okay that worried him a little bit he backed off I really have no way to access in here thinking of just pushing these pawns I think if I can get a chance, I'm gonna just trade queens and try to draw the game. If I go here and he takes, and I take and he takes. This is, uh... This is very tricky.
Okay, this is a weakness for him. He's allowed me to come in. And if I come in, he can't go here because I have check. And what does he do? He goes here and then I can trade pieces. I think this is okay. I mean, he can. It's just it's it's just a trade off for him. I'm not trying to play for a draw, but I just feel like that's what's going to happen here. Okay, if I come here, he has to defend his bishop, but he also has to defend his pawn. So he may come here. gonna come here we put, then we then we do this plan I'm just gonna go back again no because this is hanging I go here if I go here then he he takes with check not defending this anymore. He could have traded and then we trade here. checkmate if I take oh you can't can he yeah I think that's mate is that mate yeah dang it I definitely missed some stuff I was looking for a stalemate I don't know why I messed up early let's see okay let's have a look here he played with a 66.7. He played with a 79.8. So on average, he played at a 1700 and I played at a 1350. I definitely need to improve. Okay, let's uh, let's see. Okay, this is the book opening. standard stuff. Nothing really happened here. Inaccuracy. Why is this an inaccuracy? Because he takes, I take. Maybe does it allow does it allow something this square? It allows him to push up into this square with the pawn. And I can't recapture. I'm gonna have to go back here, I think. Yeah. So pushing this pawn allowed this pawn to come up. Which means I have to retreat. It's not a big inaccuracy, but it's not great. I really was just kind of cramped in here with all these pawns sort of blocking everything. Um, okay, this was a mistake. What was my best move? To push on the side here. If I pushed on the side here and maybe protect here and do something this way. Moving this pawn, maybe it weakens this square too much. He took it. And that is bad because...
yeah, I was going to say there's no way that's good. What's my best move here? Take with queen. Yeah, I guess my queen wasn't super active. I saw this square here for my knight to go to. But my queen is kind of suffocating way off here. So probably coming up here is getting her more active. I need to keep her more active. Okay. He moved the knight in. Attacking this knight. I just think to take is a mistake because this would allow this, right? Or maybe this. Okay. Saying to defend this way, on this square, um, instead of from this square. Maybe because he can take my bishop. Not sure. Okay, yeah, this was the move. <clears throat> and I know that my next move was my big mistake because this gives him a free pawn, basically. So yeah, this was a mistake, yeah. I wasn't wasn't really paying too much attention here. I should have moved here. Okay, well that was my mistake. Okay, I do move over. I should have just challenged his queen and then if he took, I could reconnect my pawn here with this pawn. I just hung a piece here. He can just take this. Wow. Can't believe that. Okay, saying so I should have should have checked with Queen because Um it gets me out of danger probably. But also then I could bring my knight over or my rook over once his rook's over. Yeah, I need to defend this square as well. So this was the right idea. I moved my king up because I was worried about defending this square, but like, I'm not. Because the pawn's always defending the queen if the queen does come in. So if I had not moved up to here, I wouldn't have been able to be checked. So that was a mistake as well. I felt like this was a weakness because it allowed me to get in and fight, but I guess it wasn't. See, my king needs to be on this square. So he found this move. And this is just a mating threat. So it's saying I should have gone here and then he would take here and maybe I go back and just hang on here. I didn't want to give him a free pawn, but going here actually gave him a mate. Yeah, it was forced. Oh dear. Not the best, but we will keep trying. I guess I am not as high as I thought I was. I'm losing to a 1600, and I'm playing an opening that I feel like I kind of know. That game just got kind of uh, cramped. I felt like it was pretty cramped. I know I can play it better than this. All right. Um, 
that's okay. I will see you guys um, on Monday. I don't post videos on Sunday, but I will see you guys on Monday. And we're going to have a whole week of just wins. See you guys soon.